Hey y'all, Kevin here, and this is Pure Reviews, where I review all kinds of products. So if you are new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And in particular, if you find this video useful or helpful, be sure to hit that like button. Maybe leave a comment saying thanks. Really helps out the channel a ton, and I greatly appreciate it. So today's product is available on Amazon, and I've included a link in the description that will take you to the product page where you can see the current price point, see if it's on sale, all that lovely information. But what is it? It is a biometric safe by a company called Bonfon. Uh, this is the product once it arrives. Uh, in addition to the safe itself, you are going to get a little box here uh, that has a little dividers, these foam dividers that you can assemble. It has uh, clear instructions on how to utilize these. These are perfect if you're using your safe to store any documents or files. I personally am storing things in here like jewelry, coins. Uh, you can also utilize this to store handguns. Um, so it has a very versatile setup. Uh, so this is a nice little touch because it's an optional item that you can assemble and put in the safe. In addition to that, you are also going to get some nice hardware here. You're gonna screw this into the wall along the back, and that's what's gonna secure the safe. So that way somebody can't just pick up the safe and walk away with it because it only weighs 45 pounds when it's empty. Obviously now when you got it full, it's gonna get super heavy, but this is going to keep somebody from walking away with it. Uh, in addition to that, they're gonna include an, a spare a little logo front. What is this used for? This is utilized right here at the front. You just simply push that and it reveals a little kind of key. And then that's where these come in play. So it provides two spare keys. In case you get locked out of your safe, your fingerprint's not working. It runs on four AA batteries. So if the batteries die on you, you can always access your safe by simply putting in the key and then turning it and opening it like so. Now, in addition to that, you obviously are going to get a user manual. Take a look through this because it's going to tell you all the different ways to program it, but it's pretty self-explanatory and easy. It also comes up with a little backup battery case uh, in addition to that. Now, as far as the safe, as you can see inside, you, it comes with two shelves, so you can set the little foam dividers on the bottom or the top. I personally, just like I said, prefer not to have those in there. Um, you can also take out the shelf. This is removable, so if you want it just fully open, you can do that. Uh, to give you an idea, this is 2.1 cubic feet uh, in here. It also has these little nubs on the outside in case you want to hang any keys. Uh, and then as far as the overall size, it is approximately 13 and three quarters inches in depth. It's about 15 inches wide, and then it's about 18 inches tall. Now, as far as the locking mechanism, you can see right here, you have these four super big locks that uh, go in and keep it nice and secure. On the top part, this is where you will put in the batteries. Like I said, it runs off of four double A batteries. And then you'll have a little uh, red button in the hinge part. That is how you're going to program and uh, set up your fingerprint or your password um, keypad. So all you have to do is simply close it and it will automatically lock uh, for you. And then how you open it with uh, your fingerprint, you just simply press your finger on the little black square and it will simply unlock. Now, you can store up to five fingerprints, so if you want to have multiple family members have access to the safe, you can easily do that. But uh, in addition to the fingerprint, if you don't want to utilize that, it does have the keypad here, which is digital backlit. So when the safe is just sitting there, you don't see the keypad, but you can simply enter in your number um, and then press the E button. Obviously, if it's not the correct uh, password, then it's going to blink like it just did. If you enter the wrong numbers, simply press the C button and it'll clear it out so you can start again. Now, another thing that this safe has, so you have the thumbprint, the keypad, you can do two authentication. So you can utilize both of these to unlock the safe if you want extra security. Then finally, it also has a virtual password. So what does that mean? That means you can put in some fake numbers at the front and at the back end and have your password somewhere in the middle. So if you have a girlfriend, boyfriend, cousin, aunt, etc., that is hanging out and you need to access something and you don't want somebody to see uh, what your true password is, 
simply add a bunch of numbers at the beginning, add a bunch of numbers at the end. You can add up to 30 numbers, and then somewhere in the middle is your true password, and it will unlock. Now, your password can be anywhere from uh, four to eight numbers, so you can make that as complicated as you wish. But overall, this is a great uh, safe for storing your uh, precious items. Like I said, it has a nice look to it. It has a cloth interior. Uh, it's got a very modern look to it by having this kind of all white front here with just this uh, thumbprint aspect to it. Uh, and then in the back, there is the little two holes, like I said, so you can mount these uh, really thick screws to a stud so that way somebody can't walk off with your safe so overall if you are in the market for a safe to uh, lock up like i said your jewelry coins money any handguns anything like that that you want to keep out of harm's way or from somebody taking this is a great option i absolutely love the aesthetics of it and i like that it has multiple ways to get into the safe and for all those reasons i do highly recommend it if there's something that I didn't cover that you're a little curious about, feel free to hit me up in the comment section. I do typically respond to those. And that is it until the next video. You guys, take it easy. Congrats, you made it to the end of the video. Thank you very much. Um, greatly appreciated for the support. Be sure to uh, hit that like button on the video. It really, really does help out. And if you have not subscribed yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell if you want to uh, get notified when new videos come out on this channel.